Are you the type of golfer who needs more power to swing the club faster and hit the ball further? If so, here's three key exercises you must be doing in your training program. In this video, we're gonna use a medicine ball or a slam ball with some throwing exercises, also referred to as ballistic exercises. These are key to improving the power and speed in your golf swing because we have to accelerate all the way through to release the ball. This is different to other exercises, which means there's more of a transfer over, which can also help with your sequencing in the golf swing and hit that ball further as a result. So the first exercise we're gonna do is an overhead slam. This is predominantly to produce some power output through those key lat muscles, which are essential to how the upper body creates its force output. So we're simply just gonna try and reach the ball to the ceiling so we get as tall as we can. And from this position, we're gonna try and throw the ball as hard as we can into the ground, keeping it close to us, using our whole body. So if we go tall and then slam, the whole body down using the leg and back muscles. The key here is doing as hard as you can for just six repetitions, keeping that energy high. The next exercise is gonna focus on an area of a body and the muscle groups that are often undertrained. They play a large role in producing speed in the golf swing. So we're gonna do a pressing, almost chest pass, where we're gonna bring one foot back, so a staggered position, we're gonna start in front and bring the ball to the chest and then explosively press forward without excessively lunging in. So we're gonna go there and then drive. And we're trying to do this with maximum power, feeling like the push, almost like we're trying to create a punching motion forward with the arms. Trying to get that real quick movement to really develop that explosive power, that ballisticness through the pectorials. We're just gonna focus on six repetitions. Guys, if you're finding this video useful, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, but also comment below with what exercises you use to help develop your power. And finally, we're gonna do a more conventional throw and exercise that is more common in golf, and that's a rotational throw. However, with this exercise, in order for it to be most effective, we need to make sure we sequence the body effectively where we utilize the ground and our rotational power. So from here, we don't wanna be just throwing the ball with the hands and arms. We wanna make sure we get that sequence where we're rotating, pushing into the lead side, rotating around the lead hip and letting go of the ball. So we've gotta get that let go, using that rotational power in the correct muscle groups, moving with as much effort as we can, trying to feel stable in the follow through, just again, doing six reps, focusing on the lead side only. As mentioned throughout the exercises, always focus on six repetitions, so you have high energy to do those power exercises, three to four sets, using a weighted ball that's around about 5% of your body weight. To help understand how these exercises can be transferred specifically to your golf swing, so you increase that power output in the gym, and then you apply it in the golf swing, watch this video next that goes into more detail of where that power comes from, and how you can transfer that technically.